We hope you learned something new today. Sharing is an important key to life and is something everyone should know. Thank you so much for coming to our home and spending time with us. We hope to see you again soon. Goodbye. Cut. That was great, everyone. You feeling okay? What? Uh, oh, yeah. I'm just tired. Mm, hungry? No, no. I'm okay. <laughs> You and I haven't eaten since we started. That was eight hours ago. Come on, I'll take you to that restaurant you like. Um, all right, fine. So smart. Lawrence, he recognizes us. Say hi. So, how is your food? Mm, they are mashed potatoes. Well, why did you order them? I'm not a fan of chewing my food. <laughs> like a baby bird? Are you done <laughs> asking me questions? <laughs> all right, all right, sorry. <sighs> no, I'm sorry. There's just a lot on my mind. I... I don't know. When you've spent your whole life studying child psychology, and you end up as a TV host who fakes smiles all day, you feel a little... Silly. Yeah, silly. I just... don't know where all my hard work has gone. You know why I picked you? To be my partner, I mean. You think my accent is funny? No. Okay, so think of us like a brain. Left side, right side. You do the research, you know, the hard work, and then I take it, I rewrite it in a way that a kid would get it, you know, and I make it pretty. We need each other. Or at the very least, I need you. Just one thing at a time, Lawrence. Here's the toys that came with your mail. And I'll see you tomorrow? Yes, see you tomorrow.
Okay, so, um, the show is doing good. Not great, but good. Since it's doing so good, I have an offer for you two. So, the other shows on Channel 6 have toys for children. I'm thinking, if you sold plush... No. We're here to teach, not sell out. Um, uh, oh, okay, okay. Well, there's a bit of a problem. You see, um, the show's not making enough money. And because of this, you might have to go on an indefinite hiatus. What? A we don't have to go on a hiatus right away. That's bullshit. Boss, we are the only educational show on Channel 6. You can't do this. Okay, um, please relax. Uh, we can all sort this out. Listen to me. Absence of mental stimulation leads to a block in brain development. Children that are attached to the show will be negatively affected. Lawrence. Tony. I don't want to do this. Uh, uh, believe me, it's... It's out of my control. Look, your ethical choices are costing you something more than just money. I'm actually trying to keep you two. You owe it to everyone to give us another chance, boss. I know, Tony. But I just can't do that. Yes, you can. Alright, if... If our next episode draws in a large enough viewing, we get to stay. How about that? And if not, we'll leave. Simple. <sighs> One more chance. If it fails, I'm sorry. Look, I really am. But that's it. Okay, let's, so let's see. School episodes... Uh, moving into a new neighborhood. We did that already. Uh, maybe um, a say no to smoking episode, right? We could talk about how bad smoking we is. We have five episodes dedicated to that. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, a pet dying? Season two, episode six. Do you not remember your own show? Well, if you're so smart, you think of something. And you do nothing. Nothing. I pitched the show. I got us off the ground. If it wasn't for me, we wouldn't even have a second chance. Both of our names are in the title, Tony. But who does all the research? I practically wrote this entire show myself. <laughs> oh, is that why Boss is on our asses? It's because you wrote all of those episodes yourself. Yeah, makes sense. Ugh. Yesterday, you... Yesterday, you were ready to give up! This is all I have, Tony. You guys are gonna do great, okay?
Thank you for the flowers, Tony. Of course! They look so nice in that vase. Oh! Oh no. Oh, man. That's okay, Lawrence. You just have to be more careful. I ruined it. It's broken. Forever. Don't worry. We can put it back together. Maybe the cracks will still show, but it can be different. Be careful of the glass. Would you still like the vase? Even if cracks show? Of course I would. What makes you say that? Do you know what the word disaster means? Disaster means a really bad thing or a bad event that happened. Ten years ago, a disaster happened to the world. I got hurt. I shattered. I was put back together. But like you said, I'm different. Forever. Different doesn't mean bad, Lawrence. The world is different after the disaster. But even though the disaster happened, I'm still here. And you're still here. And you're still the same. But I look different. That doesn't mean a thing, Lawrence. You're still the same inside. And that's what matters. I'm not really the same inside. I'm a lot more scared now. I have trouble trusting people. I'm sad a lot of the time. But you're still here. I'm still here? <laughs> if you weren't here, who would keep me company? Well, because you're still here, you can. You're still here and alive. And that's all that matters. And guess what? I still like you. With everything. Everything? That's right. Spasiva, Tony. I'm glad I'm still here with you. Me too. Now, let's glue this thing back together. Now, I hope that was good enough. No use in worrying about it now. We did our best, yeah? I do not get why boss is so hard on us. Is it really because we don't make enough money? And why does he want us to sell toys? And Tony. One thing at a time. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. I'm always right, okay? <laughs> I don't know about that one. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Good night, Al. Good night. Wait, Lawrence. Hmm? I meant what I said on the show. I like you. With everything. I like you too. With everything.